figure skating coach Rafael Harutinian spoke about the specifics of working with athletes in the United States. Earlier, Russian figure skater Elizaveta Nugumanova gave an interview in which she spoke about insults due to excess weight and threats from coaches. In America, such scandals are not uncommon. There are even special units in the structure of the National Federation that deal with such situations. It seems to me that a coach and an athlete should be attentive to each other and listen to each other. The words overweight are taboo in our country. We use the term conditions. And figure skaters are well aware that if their conditions do not meet the requirements, you can even get serious injuries in training. And you can just forget about decent results. If you constantly tell an athlete, and especially an athlete, that he is fat, the extra pounds will not go away. We can recommend contacting nutritionists and nutritionists, Harutinian said. According to Nugumanova, coach Evgeny Rukovitsin sets up other specialists not to take her. In America, everything is simple, if an athlete wants to move to another specialist, there is only one ethical point, it is necessary to call the previous mentor and find out if the potential newcomer of the group has paid him. In Russia, where the state makes a huge contribution to the training of figure skaters, everything is much more complicated. You need to write a statement, approve the transition at a federation meeting, and even meet certain deadlines. It's hard for me to imagine that someone would call the owner of the rink and say, don't take a routine to work. On the contrary, they will take him along with all the students, the coach noted.